I'm at a home here in Marin County in California, and I want to show you how a neighbor's solar installation can affect the quality of the power that comes into your home. So a few houses down the street, a residence has installed solar, and their solar installation has an inverter which creates dirty electricity or electromagnetic interference. And these frequencies go on the wiring and into all the neighboring homes. Now we can actually measure this with a meter like this, which measures the electromagnetic interference on your home wiring. Now typical homes that are connected to the grid will, will have readings around 3 to 400 millivolts. A, uh, a safe reading would be around 100 millivolts. So let's see what we have right now when we plug this in. So we're at 1500 millivolts, which is very high, but unfortunately that's very common for a solar system. And that's what most of the homes in this neighborhood are right now uh, reading. So fortunately, the readings will go down quite a bit once the sun goes down and that inverter slows down. In this home, the readings around 10 p.m. are around 100 millivolts, which is very clean power. But as you can see, one inverter is polluting the electricity for an entire neighborhood. And this is something that's happening more and more as solar becomes much more popular. And I've had multiple families that have contacted me and said that their health has been harmed by solar installations, either on their own home or on their neighbor's homes. And this is something that doesn't need to happen. We can create uh, a safer solar technology with filtering techniques and creating safer inverters that don't create dirty power. This is the way that we're going to create a solar technology which is truly sustainable for our society.